What's up guys, Tony Rican here, and today I'm having fun and throwing down making a mac and cheese chicken pot pie. And you know exactly what this is, don't you? That's right, this is awesome. So let's just go and get started and jump right into this one. This is a super simple, really easy recipe. Go ahead and start by preheating your oven to 350 degrees. Then, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my butter and start melting this down. And while that melts, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna chop up some carrots, some celery, and some onion, and we'll add it into that melted butter and start to saute those. After all my vegetables that I had time to soften up, I'm gonna go ahead and sprinkle some flour over this. I'm gonna stir this and let it cook for about a minute. After about a minute, I'm gonna slowly add my milk and chicken broth and mix that together. Once I've got that mix so it's nice and smooth, I'm gonna go ahead and bring this to a simmer, then I'll reduce my heat and I'll let it go for about three or four minutes to allow this to thicken up. Now once that's thickened to where I want it, I'm gonna take my parsley and my thyme, along with some salt and pepper and mix that in. Then I'm going to take some shredded cheddar cheese, put that in there. I'll mix that in and allow it to melt. And while that melts, I'm going to go ahead and take some pasta that I cooked up, my chicken, and some peas and toss this all together. Then I'm going to go ahead and pour that into my cheese sauce and mix it. Then I'm gonna go ahead and take some sliced American cheese, put that over the top, and then I'll pop this in my oven for about 10 minutes. After 10 minutes in the oven, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some crackers, crumble those over the top. Then I'm gonna take the rest of my shredded cheddar, sprinkle that over the top, then we'll pop this back in the oven for about another eight to 10 minutes. And that's it guys, this one is done. Just take a look at how it came out. It looks awesome. My cheese is all melted over the top. Everything in there is nice and thick and looks great. But you know, I can't just look at this. We just gotta go ahead and dig in and give this one a try. This is heaven. You guys are gonna love this one. Go ahead, like, share, comment down below if you need complete printable step-by-step -step instructions. Check out AverageGuyGourmet.com. Give this one a try, subscribe to my channel, and we'll see you guys next time.